Today I'm going to show you how to set up an FTP user on your WP Engine site. So WP Engine actually does it a little bit differently. They have SFTP users. Now what that stands for is Secure File Transfer Protocol. It's just more secure way to upload your files to the server. So go ahead and click that link. It's going to take you over to the SFTP user section. And down here you'll see the SFTP address and the port number. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to copy that and I'm going to have a notepad pulled up where I paste that on the other screen. And then I'm going to hit create SFTP user and you can name this whatever you would like. So I'm just going to name it user3. For password, you just click on this lock and it will generate a password for you. So I'm going to write down the password, but I am not going to write down the username yet because WP Engine modifies it slightly. Uh, when we hit for path, if you want them to have access to a secret folder on the server, uh, or whatever the name of it is, if you can spell, um, then you just put slash and put the path in there. Um, as to what folder you would like this user to have access to. So if somebody's uploading files to a specific folder, maybe a photographer or a videographer, and you want them to upload their files straight to your server, you can do that uh, by using the path folder. I'm going to leave this blank. This is going to give that user full access to everything on the server. Uh, so I've got the password, and we're going to hit add STFTP user. Now when you do that, WP Engine appends the username with the install name. Uh, in this case, it's the curtain shop dash user3. And so we're going to copy that. That is actually going to be your username. If you try to use user3 as your username, you will not be able to connect. So I've got all of the information uh, written down here on a notepad ready to give someone else uh, that will log into the server. And that is very simply how you create an SFTP user on WP Engine.